I'm Nathan and today in this PSLE 2018 Paper 2 question series, I'll be going through question 2. In my channel, I aim to help all of you master all those concepts out there, okay? So let's jump straight into question 2. So this is question 2 and this question is testing us on speed. Let's read the question first. Eric took two hours to travel three-fifths of his journey. He completed the remaining 84 kilometers in one hour. What was Eric's average speed for the whole journey? Okay, so let's highlight the key information now. So Eric took two hours to travel three-fifths of his journey, okay? So three-fifths of his journey was traveled three in two hours, okay? He completed the remaining 84 kilometers in one hour. That means that two fifths is 84 kilometers and he did it in one hour. So they are asking us, what is Eric's average speed for the whole journey? Okay, what is average speed? We know what is speed, distance and time from the DST triangle, right? But we don't really know what is average speed. Average speed is just like speed, but it's with the... So... Every speed is actually the same formula. So speed is distance over time, right? Every speed is total distance over total time. So it's like, so total time is two hours plus one hour. Total distance is uh, 84 kilometers plus something, okay? So this is how you find average speed. So first, this is the formula for average speed. So I'm going to take 5 over 5 minus 3 over 5, which is 2 over 5. So we know that two fifths of his journey was spent on 84 kilometers, right? So you know that two units is 84 km. So one unit is supposed to be 84 km divided by two, which is 42 kilometers. Okay, so I'm going to find five units. So five units is basically the whole journey's, um, the whole journey's distance, okay? So this is basically the total distance, which is 42 times five, which is 210 kilometers. So this is the total distance. So we have one checked in our list. So total distance is checked. But we need to know total time now. So 2 hours plus 1 hours is total time. So it's really easy to find the total time. So it's 3 hours. So we have another one total time. So now it's really easy to find the average speed, right? Because we have both of them. So average speed is equal to total distance over total time. So it's basically 2 210 divided by 3 hours, which is 70 kilometers per hour. Okay, so this is the answer for part for question 2. And I hope you understand my explanation for this question, question 2. And thank you and bye-bye. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!